everybody, it's Margaret. Welcome to my channel, Texas Gal Treasures. In today's video, we've got two big bunches of knots that were in a Goodwill blue box that I opened live, but couldn't detangle in that video. So I thought we would take the time in this one, we would detangle them and see what else is in there because uh, we pulled, we did end up pulling out a sterling silver rosary with a nice crucifix. So there might be goodies tangled up in all of this mess. So I'm going to separate it into the, there was like two chunks. We'll, we'll detangle them and we'll look at what we've got. Here. All right, so let's get detangling. Okay, so first up we've got this layered necklace. It's got three layers. One says love, there's a little rose, and then this heart. This is one that I will likely just put into a lot because there's a little bit of wear to the gold tone finish. So that's what's gonna happen with that one. This necklace, this one's pretty nice. So we've got kind of a bib style with different colored rhinestones, kind of a gray gunmetal color, white. So that was actually kind of pretty and there's no stones missing. It's a clear necklace, but I think I might be able to try to sell this one. So that's one I will attempt to sell. There were a few necklaces like this one. I like the medallion on it. This actually may be an anklet now that I'm looking at it. Yeah, I think this might be an anklet. But again, the the wear and the finish on it is kind of rubbed off. So this one is another that I'll just put into a craft wear repair lot. A few other bracelets here that are just kind of like meh. May or may not have been worth detangling for it all, but I did find one nice piece, so that's good. So these We'll go to just a craft wear repair lot. Same with this one. Now this is a cool necklace. It's broken. Is it? Yeah, it's pretty easy to fix, I think, though. I can just hook this jump ring back onto this bird here. It kind of has a Betsy Johnson look to it. I'm not sure that it is. So I, yeah, I will likely go ahead and just hook these hook this little bird back on and sell this. I like that it's kind of like this cherry blossom look with the birds and the gold roses and the black. I, I really like that one. So this is one I will try to sell. Next, this one I'm on the fence about. It's got this black kind of antiqued chain. I like the pendant. It's got this tarnished silver look, however, I don't think it's silver. And then this blue square, kind of rounded off square pendant. It's actually kind of pretty. I like the pendant a lot on this one. So I may go ahead and try to sell this one. Uh, I'll have to look it up and see what I think. Oh, my fingers are so dirty. Uh, but yeah, this is one I may actually try to sell because it's pretty. Oh my gosh, my fingers are so gross right now. <laughs> Then another necklace. This one, the, the gold tone is kind of wearing off a little bit. I'm not sure. The maker's mark on this one looks like a little origami star, but this is one I'll just put into a lot. This will go to a lot as will this one probably. I'm gonna look at this one a little closer. It's got a nice hidden clasp there, but these pearls I'm not so sure about let me look in those in the holes there yeah those will go to a lot then there's this necklace looks like the silver finish is rubbing off on this one as well and then this necklace <sighs> um, I like this little medallion on it that's really sweet but yeah I'm probably just gonna go ahead and put this into a lot as well 
This will go to a lot. This little locket I thought was pretty cute, but it's the wear on it's pretty rough. It's like so, and then it is a clear, so that will go to a lot. Then there's this chain that was broken, but let's take a look at what this tag says on it. Okay, that says Napier, but it is broken. <laughs> now, here we go. This is the one that I was really trying to get out of that giant tangle. It's got a nice silver chain, a nice little pendant here, and the little pendant says, I love you, with some stars. And I believe that this is silver. Yeah, that is 925 Italy on the chain. The back, it says, to the moon and back, which is so sweet. I love you to the moon and back. And I am guessing that this pendant is also silver. But yeah, that is really sweet. I love you to the moon and back. That's one I will sell. And then this was another one that was tangled up in there. It's got a little elephant, but again, the wear is really bad on it, so I will put that in a lot. And then there was this little, I guess it's a little toe ring, but that will also go to a lot. I don't think it's silver or anything, so that's what I'm gonna do. I would go wash my hands, but I know it's just, they're just gonna get dirty again, detangling this. So maybe after I detangle this, I'll go wash the grossness off my fingers. All right, let me start detangling this and we'll take a look at the next bunch. Alright, so this I'm gonna go ahead and just put in a lot because it's still really super tangled. Next is this necklace. It's got this graduated, kind of druzy crystal look to it with this long gold tone chain. This is something that I will probably try to sell. It's it's kind of pretty. I'm gonna like that. This looks like just a silver chain. It's kind of kinked and everything, but I will go ahead and just put this with my scrap silver. And then here we've got a woven necklace that's got these Hamsa hands on it. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right, but, um, but yeah, I'm gonna put this in a lot because I don't like things with cords. I don't know. Ugh. And then we've got this bracelet, it's, you know, shedding beads, so this will go to a lot. And then this bracelet, it's, it's kind of cool, but again, some of the win finish is wearing off, so that will go to a lot. Got a lot going to a lot, but some, some cool stuff too. I like this one. I do, I'm not a fan of the cords, as I just stated, but I like these cobalt blue blingy little beads with the flowers. So this will go to a lot because somebody will enjoy playing with that, I'm sure. Uh, this is another one of those that I'm always iffy about selling. I don't know. I guess I should just try and see if somebody likes it and would want to buy it. Uh, I will try, I will try and sell this. This one is going to a lot. It caused so much trouble. There are wires and all kinds of things. Everything was just tangled into this. It was a mess. And broken now. Same with this one. Lots of things were tangled all in these flowers. This is, I can't really read that mark. Anyway, so that's gonna go to a lot. I almost gave up on this necklace, but I really liked it. 
This is really feminine and delicate. It's a nice gold tone chain. It's got these cute little barrels uh, in between some of the links of chain. I mean, it's not gold, like real gold, but I think somebody would like it. It's very sweet and feminine and dainty, so I will sell this one. Here is another that was really twisted up in there. Oops. Um, and I like this one a lot as well, so I will definitely sell this one. It looks like it might be silver with like a rhodium plate on it, but let me get my magnet. So I think the chain could be silver. Um, yeah, I don't see any marks, so I'm not sure about that, but I definitely like it. So that's one I will try to sell too. This one, Hmm, I mean, it's got a little Florida charm and it's got longitude, latitude on it, but that will go to a lot. And then this one. Hmm, I'm on the fence about this. I don't know. I'm just not a fan of the colors, but again, it's not for me, so maybe I should just try. The colors seem kind of like muddy to me, but somebody might like that. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I'll try to sell this one as well. And then there's this little butterfly brooch. People like butterflies. Do they like this style of butterfly? I don't know. Urgh, I'm on the fence about this one. I, I might. I'm going to look it up because people like butterflies. All right, so that's it for our tangly bits that we had. So I hope you enjoyed watching me detangle and seeing what was all in there. So there was some good stuff tangled up. Uh, and I'll talk to you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.